Welcome back everyone and in today's video we're going to be talking about mobile mapping and something well quite mega exciting has dropped. It's an all new mobile mapping system. Today is the day where I get to show you guys the biggest most impressive advancement in hardware for mobile mapping. I present to you the VMS. Same color in your eyes, all your thoughts to crave, done civilized, have we both gone mad? Today is the day that I am going to share with you guys the biggest step forward and advancement when it comes to mobile mapping. Yes, there is a new kid on the block and this kid is a little bit like Apple in terms of the iPhone, in terms of just everything Apple's ever done. This is the Apple of the mobile mapping world, only... Uh, it's called Via Metris and it is mind blowing. Welcome back to the channel folks. And today, like I just said, I'm gonna be introducing you to a new product called the Via Metris. Why am I so excited about this product? Well, as you know, on the channel, I've been covering mobile mapping and everything to do with point clouds, mesh models, and just basically the future of construction when it comes to like digital twins and mapping projects and building information into that. So I'm so excited about like the technology side of construction right now. And as you know, if you've been watching the channel over the last 12 months, I've been looking into the best hardware out there for mobile mapping as well as software. Now, until this date, there has only been a few products really out there that are doing the mobile mapping side of things. So what do I mean by mobile mapping? I mean basically hardware that sits on a car or on a person and you walk with it or drive with it and it maps an area, a little bit like Google Earth, but in the surveying and construction world, something that is far more advanced. So what is the Via Metris? Why is it here? Where does it fit within the market? And how goddamn good is it? Well, it's amazingly good, I can tell you that. Now, before we get into the main crux of this video and I share with you exactly why I think the Via Metris is gonna just blow every other hardware out of the water, let's watch the trailer for Via Metris because quite frankly, it's pretty badass.
Also, if that doesn't get your juices going, then I don't know what will. Right, so the Viometris. Essentially, the biggest selling point here is not only the spec of the hardware, so like the cameras, the GPS, the IMU sensor, not just that, but for me, it is the ability to put this product on your back, like the Navis, but also to be able to mount it on a car, like the Trimble. Not only that, you can take it off your back, so if it's up here, it might hit into things, you can actually mount it on your chest. These guys have thought of everything. Another huge advantage is if you wanna map somewhere that you can't take a car and you can't walk, you could use a scooter or you could use a quad bike. Why? Well, because the IMU sensor in this bad boy is so good that literally you can pretty much mount it to anything except a dog or a cat because, well, be animal cruelty. So for me, Viometris already blows everything else out of the water because the Navis has to be worn and can't be taken off and mounted on anything else. The Trimble has to be put on top of a car. The Leica has to be put on top of a car, can't, can't be taken off and put on you in person. So Viometris literally, these guys have quite clearly spoken to engineers, they've spoken to surveyors, they've really taken on board what it is that we wanted and what we need. And this is mind blowing because they've then gone and created what I believe is the next step in mobile mapping and quite an awesome solution. A little bit biased, yes I am, but bear with me. Here's the technical details and you can decide for yourself. So let's talk about the scanner resolution. So LiDAR accuracy is five mil. Scanner capacity is from, I believe, 320,000 points per second up to 640,000 points per second. Pfft, that's a lot of points. Detection range, naught to 120 meters. That's far. That is far. That is not putting this thing on a tripod and then moving it every 10, 15, 20 meters like I've had to do with the Trimble X7. So it's kind of blowing a traditional laser scanner out of the water. Now a laser scanner does have its place because it is far cheaper, but come on. All right, now let's talk about the camera because for me, a lot of these products are missing amazing cameras. And with the pixels that are available out there at the moment, you know, putting a 10 megapixel camera on a piece of kit, is just, it's just not gonna work anymore. So this one has four 24 megapixel cameras, CMOS global shutter, frame rate five images per second. What? Yes, that's pretty cool. The Viometris also comes with lights. Yes, it has integrated lights in it. So if you're gonna go into a dark area to scan, no problem because it's got lights. Now, the really important thing about the Viometris is it has a banging IMU, which is why you can mount this pretty much anywhere. Tripod, car, person. Obviously, it's SLAM, GNNS receiver, so works with GPS. And the great thing is this, is you can connect it to pretty much any phone. So there's no screen that you need to be looking at. You can literally just whip out your phone, connect instantly to the Wi-Fi on the backpack, and then you are good to go. I have used this last week for a test and it's just so simple and so easy to use. So there you have it. I've only really just touched on the amazing abilities of this new mobile mapping system. But I wanted to kind of get this video out there to make you guys aware. We are gonna be taking this out into the field next week and be doing a live project. This is probably gonna be involved putting it on a car. We maybe throw it on a tripod. We're gonna throw it on a person. <sighs> Yeah, I'm excited. Uh, the one thing that I did notice with the Biometris, um, having used it very briefly last week, as you can see in the little demo video here, is you don't need to stop. I'm just so in love with the Biometris already because like the GPS that the Navis just doesn't have instantly means you haven't got to faff around on site with control. I love the fact that you don't have to walk and then stop walk and then stop. I love the fact that you can then just chuck it on the car and go. So you just have the ability to scan everything. For me, this is what I've been waiting for. This is the ultimate mobile mapping hardware. Comment down below, tell me about what systems you've used, what you like about them, what you don't like about them, whether you think the Viometris has kind of filled those gaps. Hit that subscribe button, come back soon because we're gonna be using the Viometris live out in the field and I am, well, very excited.